So this one is Godzilla Raids again. Okay, the artwork's very entangled there. It's good. So this one's from 1955 to 81 minutes. Man, it felt longer than 81 minutes. It's been on the background. This one's all in Japanese again. Again, like me, it's all in black and white and grainy. Uh, looked a little bit better. It's confusing because the Godzilla, he's definitely dead at the end of the other one. He's skeletons knocking around on the floor of the ocean and it bubbles away. And um, there's a lot of plane flying in this movie. And there's two guys flying around. One makes a version crash land and lands on this little island. You know, it's just Godzilla just hanging out there fighting Anglus. So we get Anglus in this movie. So Anglus appeared. You know, they're just having a fight. Now, yeah, that's pretty much about what's going to happen. Um, it's weird because that happens then. Um, I think the first one. It goes off and has these backstories and shouting on the radars and rescue teams and you know and it's it's pretty odd and then we get a massive fight and when we get a fight eventually again on the islands it's dead fast and they're all moving dead fast they jerky movements there's a couple of buildings get smashed it's pretty cool but then Angus meets his demise with a good old bite to the back of the neck like that and he's gone and you think all right where's this going now and Godzilla fucks back off to his little island now we get this backstory of Winter. And like it's weird as well because at the start of the movie when they get Godzilla's back and like they pretty much just show you the highlights reel of the first movie on the projector. There's no audio, it's silence. It's got all it's just actual film. It's not like you know, quirky stuff where there's alternative angles, you know, it's just like, yeah, you're watching the film. <laughs> so Godzilla's real, is he? Okay. But no, it powers on. Um a lot of plane flying. I mean I was getting to the point at the end of watching that. I see if I see one more flying V, and then the next team was a flying V. I was like, oh my god, it's flying V. And then it takes about 10 minutes from the very Godzilla at the end on the ice. Um, big chunks of ice. The Godzilla suit as well is very slimmer compared to the first movie because this, this model here is based on the original. And he's a very, very chunky little Godzilla. I mean, huge feet. Um, but this one is very, very skinny. Um, pretty cool. Animation, but it's really. I mean, for fifty for a film from fifty five, it's class. You know I mean, they've done a lot more, but the story just waffles on in the middle. The the world's greatest actors back in, but then like there's no pirate patch guy because he went down the bottom of the ocean. Um, but yeah, raids again. Um, that's the first time I've actually seen that one. Um, I know Road Down was a standalone movie. Um, I generally, I think when I did the unboxing, I thought Rodan was in it, even though there's clearly a picture of Angus there. Um, I just want a quick look, seeing the same actors. So it's what's pretty cool about getting this book. Um, so Professor Yamai is back in this. Um, from top build to middle build. Um, he's really the only other name I can spot. Different director. Horns beating in the background. But yeah. Um, financial access to the original Godzilla uh, made bringing the movie back and easier for Toho. The studio did by the following year. So it was the following year this came out. Already moved projects, new director. Yeah. Braids again. Largely carried out. Yeah. So no, it was alright, alright entry. Uh, Godzilla vs King Kong is on the same disc, so I'll be doing that next. Probably not tonight. It's just gone midnight, but yeah. Um it was alright. I say dead skinny, weird little Godzilla. But he's been necking, been burning the ice so they haven't killed him off. But he just appears, it's like, it's hanging out on the island. <laughs> See it now, thanks. So we had Godzilla, and this was Godzilla Raids again the following year. Then it was whew, eight years to we got Godzilla vs King Kong. It's a big jump there, and this one will be in colour, won't it? Then we had Mothra the next year, the same year we had King Ghidorah. 
the year after that invasion of the Astro Monkeys. Monkeys. Yeah, so it was pretty steady 60s, wasn't it? To the mid 70s. So, yeah. I pretty much, from here on, I've probably seen them all. I can't wait to see some of the nostalgia ones because I was. I remember I'm um, just ramming up there. I like I fell asleep watching a Godzilla not long back. I'm just gonna grab this one. This is Terror Meta Godzilla on VHS. Um, includes the original Japanese trailers. I put one of these on. In honesty, it had about eight trailers. <laughs> uh, forefront and video. It's really cool. I think there's only two of these I don't have, and I can never work out which one it is. Every time I see one, I buy it. I refuse to deceive it. There was plenty of them around to track down. But yeah, I just remember, like, I think I fell asleep before the trailer montage had finished. Right, let's see what Godzilla vs. King Kong is like. It's got a brain the size of a pea. Right, see you next time. Thanks for watching. Goodbye for now. And now, the end is here.